Hey y'all, so Bus and I came to get a new tire on a ride because our tire was falling apart. So we went on and took advantage of doing it now while the kids are all in school. And at first they were saying we had to make an appointment cause we didn't make no appointment. And then we was like, we only got one tire. This is an emergency. Can we please be seen? We'll sit around and wait for a little bit if we have to. But that's what we're doing now. So he went to go show them what the tire looked like. And um, yeah, that's what we're doing right now, y'all. I thought I'd bring y'all with me because today is Thursday. And I was trying to have something up by the end of this week. I've been actually vlogging all week. I just haven't did no editing. So I'll probably do that editing tonight. Um, yeah, so we're here getting a new tire on the ride. So we don't have no crazy accidents. <laughs> we're always last minute when it comes to taking care of the car. So that's something we got to start doing more and paying more attention to because we need a ride, y'all. I'm just waiting for him to come in and let me know how long. And then from here, I think we're gonna go find something to eat and probably go to the mall because he wanted to go find him some uh, shorts because it's been hot for the last four days and we haven't had no shorts to put on. We both gained a little weight. I need to get some uh, personal hygiene things and I'll be just bringing you along with us guys. So stay tuned. Hey y'all, so we, um, just got our tire on. Feel good about that. Now we are on our destination to a mall. We're going to the Ross one. Mm -hmm. We're going to hit a Groville Mall. It is so nice out here today. The sun is shining. My skin is glowing a little bit. Charlie's hoagie. Thank you, Hey, John. Y'all, I didn't never think I was going to need to be in one of these. Yeah, y'all. I'm cruising. Cruising. Nice. What are you doing? I got whips. Been dipping on him all day. <laughs> What's those lamb chops? So we got our beef cubes seasoned. Um, we got Sean the seasoning to use. Okay, use this right here. Mm-hmm. 
Okay. And that's all you use? No. Worcestershire. Worcestershire, okay. I use soy, soy sauce. And nature seasoning. Nature's blend. And you know. Your pepper. Your, your salt and your pepper. You use ginger. I smell ginger. Yeah, I use ginger. So we got our beef cubes all seasoned up. And we got our garlic and our ginger. Oh my goodness. Gradually goes up. That's it. Might go down too, though, but today is a decent day. Okay, I done went on and cut my peppers all up. We got the orange bell pepper, the yellow, the red, and a onion. We're going to go ahead and get these sauteed as well. So we just added some beef broth. To all the seasoning and the juices from the meat sitting in the skillet, and we're going to saute the veggies up in this. super exhausted so after we got the uh, tires on the car we didn't make it to the mall we didn't sit down and eat anything we just went to the grocery store did some shopping for the house because we didn't have a few things that we needed for ourselves and the kids so I'm literally just now sitting down it's just been a mess this week y'all like I told y'all I had foot surgery I'm in a surgical shoe. I just been like lounging around the house. And you know sometimes when you lounge around the house more than often, your house end up being a total disaster because you're not really on top of it like you normally do. So my husband, he been the best. He been definitely trying to uh, keep things in order around here with the cooking and driving and doctor's appointments, school and cleaning. But you know, a mother's job is just, you know, it's just really never done. And for us to clean in, my husband does a wonderful job, but it's just not my type of cleaning. <laughs> it's just not, it's not my cleaning. So I had to do some stuff, y'all. I'm just now sitting down, I'm lightheaded. I have a headache. I'm just now eating something and it's not much. I just got a pear. Yeah, man. He did make me some uh, macaroni tuna salad, so I do got uh, some of that. I didn't even get none of that yet, but I'm going to get some of that with some crackers. But I ended up getting some pineapple, a pear, some grapes, and some berries. And I got some ice water. I got the worst headache in the world right now. The worst headache. But I was going to just come and show y'all a few things I did end up getting from the store today. I told y'all I was going to go grab some things that I was out of. And then once I was getting the things that I was out of, I came across a few other little things. So I like this little um, premium cotton round dispenser. It's a little dispenser, and it got 80 of them in there. And then I came across this rose water um, hand wash for the bathroom. And excuse my nails, y'all. My nails are hideous. I do have a nail appointment tomorrow, but I don't know if I'm gonna make it or not because I got some more things I gotta take care of. I end up coming across that for the bathroom. I also end up coming across this St. Ives, St. Ives, St. Ives body wash in this rose water as well. I don't normally buy St. Ives, but I said I'll give this a try because it was pink and it's cute. And it got uh, made with 100% natural rose and ole, ole 
Vera extracts made with plant-based cleansers and made with no animal derived ingredients. It's paraben free and refreshes for a balanced feel. So we'll see what this is about y'all. I'll let you guys know how I like this. My one and only face wash I ever used. My husband all time favorite lotion. Everyone loves this lotion in the house. I just started using this lotion because it's a really good lotion, don't get me wrong, but it always makes me feel extra oily and like wet. But it's really good. It got the little almond oil in there and it's like really good for really dry skin. So I just started using that one. And then I came across this Water Rose Micellar uh, Water. I normally get the green one, but I don't know what it is with the pink today, y'all. I've just been getting everything pink. But this uh, has rose water in it as well. So I wanted to give this a try, see how that works on my face. And now I got that real crazy sensitive skin. So, and then we end up coming across all these vitamins. It was buy one fifty percent off, so we went on and got them. So we came across the Nature's Truth Apple Cider Vinegar, and y'all gonna hear my kids. The kids is home from school, so y'all know how that is. Apple cider vinegar, um, and it's got six hundred milligram per serving. Seventy-five vegan gummies. Sheila would like to say hi, guys. Go ahead, Sheila. Hello. My birthday's in seven more days at tomorrow. Uh, she's been counting down on birthdays. And then we end up getting the hair, skin, and nails. This got 80 vitamins in it. Vegan. My husband ended up coming across the black elderberry gummies with vitamin C and zinc. This got 50 vegan vitamins in it. Black elderberry is supposed to be real good for you. I'm gonna do some more research on this, but he was trying to put me D with this, y'all. I said, I gotta do some research on that. And then he got the extra strength melatonin, 10 milligrams, 70 vitamins. And this is for us because we've been having a hard time sleeping at night. Yeah, y'all, that is all we end up getting from the store today for stuff like that other than the groceries and um yeah that's all we got we got groceries but i didn't really show all that but um we're making that pepper steak right now so i will show y'all how that pepper steak came along after everything is done i'm just putting everything back in the bag for me to take everything back out the bag i don't know why i just did this but i'm gonna sit here and relax for a minute y'all and i'll get back with y'all in a little bit like I told y'all, I have a banging headache. I'm just now sitting down and I'm gonna finally get to my fruit. So I'll see y'all in a little bit. We are now at the end of this vlog. I hope you all enjoyed every bit of it. If you did, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you all so much for watching and don't forget to stay blessed. Thank you.